Wagwan people, welcome to another episode of Poppy Show. This video is pretty much geared towards red flags when you first start dating someone. It's a way for you to identify if this person is good for the relationship over a longer period of time or if, if you should just cut it, you know what I mean? So we're gonna throw some things out there and if it's a red flag, we're gonna be waving our red flags and if it's not, we'll say it's not and we can discuss it further. And before you go any further, please remember if it's your first time here, subscribe, like the channel and also hit the notification bell. And make sure you thumbs up this video as well, okay? All right, so first one, they can't stop telling you how perfect you are. Would you give that a red flag? If someone can't stop telling you how perfect you are? Yeah. Stop. I don't think that that's a red flag. If I'm too nice? compliment can, every minute you're perfect but if you're perfect why not i mean so who perfect if a guy's telling me how perfect i am of course i'm gonna endorse it all the way 100 percent. i don't see that as a red flag i would actually love it actually watch the brother there are the girl there why is that a red flag though but nobody not perfect so if over and over them is perfect perfect that's all like said so i'm just i don't know that's all like a red flag to me you're perfect and everything. Guys, you really think that's a red flag if someone is complimenting you and telling you how perfect you are and stuff? I mean, you have guys who don't ever tell you that you look nice. So, yeah, if, if a guy, you know, keeps telling me that repeatedly, of course, I'm going to be like, oh, sure. But the funniest thing, a guy not telling you that you're perfect is kind of normal because so the man must hear. But for the man that tell us that you're perfect or the girls that tell us that you're perfect, that's kind of... I'm perfect. Oh uh, yeah, but do I tell you every day? That's why you should I get a red flag. <laughs> Omar 12 years, so I mean something right, right? <laughs> exactly. Okay. The next one is their sex drive is much higher or lower than yours. Red flag for me. If them sex drive drive well, higher or lower? Too high. Especially <laughs> at my age, you know. I don't want nobody with no high sex drive. I can't manage it. Maybe in my younger years. In my younger years, yes. So that would be cool. But right now for me, let God forbid we don't work out and I meet somebody out there. And the sex drive too high for me. A red flag for me. I'm sorry. I can't bother. I don't have time to impress nobody at my age. Right about. Well, the only, the I'm just saying. <laughs> but if I was younger, then. It's a red flag for me too, but the only reason why it's a red flag mm -hmm. is if it one will lower. Can't boss you know. Really? If it lower than mine? No man, I'm not I'm not there with nobody with them sex drive lower than mine right now. No man, you have to you have And to, it feel high. Yeah, and for them one lower. And fear go high too. The, oh. No, yeah, we high together. <laughs> we stay high. What? No man. Okay then. That's frustration. CMPS. Mm -hmm. Are even if she looks a higher, I'm gonna work with it. But you got lower? No, bad man. No lower thing. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. But if yours is, but if your if your sex drive is high, well, no, high, high normal. So. Mm -mm. High for me is normal. Anything under them, other than my level, abnormal. Straight red flag. Okay. That's the thing then. All right, Mr. Paul. The Mr. next one is. They describe all their exes as crazy yeah that, that's a red flag so how come the one of them had a problem no i'm gonna share the problem man no i'm not the one of them crazy no i'm gonna really I'm not re no so no she... it could be no I, I wouldn't give that a red flag it could be that she she's just been meeting the wrong men something wrong with See her what i'm saying something so, wrong with she so maybe she needs to kind of reevaluate and you know the kind of guys that she she's attracted to or whatever red flag but because she meet me that means i'm the wrong person to have to tell somebody else i'm crazy oh man a red flag that's a straight red flag everybody had a problem no she has a problem because the right guy just hasn't come around yet red flag next one if they call you names in arguments red flag 
You ain't gonna call me no names. Yeah, don't consistently do it, but I mean, you know, in, a, in a the heat of the moment, people do call, and then I really, it, you know what I mean? But people must learn to control themselves. And if you're dating someone and they already start calling you names, can you imagine how that list is gonna extend once you guys get in deeper? Yeah. I mean, he's clearly showing you how the, ta the type of person he is. Not that true, but one to them one day when they're calling your name, and as soon as you get involved long term now, as your marriage so crazy, name start call out. I mean, and I wonder if I hide the thing. Well, that you can't help it. But I mean, if if it's right in your face, then of course, you know, you have the choice not to deal with it. I think it's natural for like a rare occurrence, you know what I mean? Especially if the argument really heated. And it depends on the name what I'm calling it, you know what I mean? It now goes too extreme. Not the B word or you know what I mean? Them kind of thing. But me, well, I mean, everyone calls someone them the name there. Maybe like if, if, if I want to say, go a girl. Yeah, that's another thing. I don't like men styling me as no gal. Never have. Like, I don't think that's cute at all. Like, no, bro. You're not going to call me no gal around. Uh, maybe not gal, but what, what about your fool, like? No, I mean, nobody call me no fool either. Me <laughs> are no fool. Me have sense. <laughs> well, I guess that name call it. <laughs> Like that's so good, give me the name. Call yeah. me Latoya. My name is Latoya. And if it's too long for you, just say Toya. And I'm good. Yeah. When me and Oni get in an argument, we call each other by our right name. So, exactly. So, so we know it's our mad, you know what I mean? That is true. <laughs> <laughs> true enough. Yeah, we call each other honey all true. the time. Yeah. But when we in an argument, we say Ian. Latoya. Latoya. Yeah. So me know when I'm upsetting, it's like, Latoya, you don't hear me talking to you? Yeah. And me just know I'm irritating. <laughs> straight, straight, straight. <laughs> Yeah. All right, the next one. They have no work work ethic. Yeah. Everybody have to work. Exactly. Yeah, man, yeah, man. You can't yeah. deal with the money when I ask him, so where, where, where have you worked in the past? You know, just to kind of have a little history. Oh, me used to work here, so I worked. How long did you work there? Oh, I worked there for about three months. Okay, so what happened to the previous job before that? So like an oh, interview. I worked <laughs> I worked there six months. You just know said so that now go work out. It now go work out. Well, I'm not conduct my interview them with still, but I'm not, I'm not deal with the woman them where feel like say the man alone for go work. You know what I mean? Or man for pay all of the bills them and them thing them. I don't have a problem paying all the bills providing that I can do that. But if the woman and the man are work and you can't say the man are struggle and you are work too and feel like the man alone for pay the bills. You have to, you have to pitch in. So that's where my thing come in. I feel like say, in a relationship, if me and make the money can cover the bills and even put aside some money same way, yeah, we'll do that. Simple one too. But if me a struggle and she a work and me a struggle just because she feel like say, a man for cover the bills, them red flag. Straight. <laughs> and I guess it goes for men too. Because yes, no when I take up no man when I work. A straight red flag. Because me have kids and me have to tell my son them say yo, the woman have a rate yo when she can know say yo, you are struggling and she are pitching. You know what I mean? Love that. I tell my daughter, see him, don't make your husband feel say you love him and he must struggle and you I say you are him for do everything and no 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 no. I don't really can do them kind of thing. So it goes both ways. Man and woman love each other enough for no say yo. If you have a struggle, we wanna struggle together. And when he might rise, we wanna rise together. One, two. The next one is if they're mean to their parents. Red flag. I uh, see. Because you don't know some mommy have to get taken care of. And daddy too. Appearance is an appearance. Well, well, yeah, and daddy too. <laughs> daddy too. <laughs> if I come here, yeah, the first day, yeah, you're gonna get an argument. You're done. <laughs> No, but your parents, I said parents, right? Yeah, but you said mommy, mommy, mommy. No, I just said mommy, I forget taking. Of course, definitely daddy, I forget taking care of. I just said mommy, I forget taking care Yeah, yeah. I'm not really, I mean, it depends, because if I come in your house and I say your mother, pick an argument with you. And you're going to say, well, I saw she stay, you know what I mean? I kind of red flag, because I don't want them kind of mother in law, they were just always an argument, always an argument. But if I, you pick the argument, or if the mother in law, or the mother, your mother just simply say one, two, and it's a big thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, children are fair of respect. Yeah, you know what I mean? I'm not really fancy them kind of thing. So, I have to just use them sleep that mark that. Yeah, and especially on a woman's perspective, if if she's dating a guy and um, he, he, you know, he hasn't spoken to his mother in a long time yeah. and, you know what I mean, birthday come, he don't even remember his mother's birthday mm -hmm. or whatever, like, what do you think he gonna do with you? Like, you know, yeah. so that's definitely a big red flag. Mm -mm, no good. Bye. It's true. So I have to big up the parents yeah. down here. Red flag. Alright, so their attitude changes on a dime. 
No, 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 red flag. I mean, everybody stay that way right now. Yeah. Yo, me, me, things change, things yeah. happen. Me moody. Sometimes I just Being want my worse. space. Trust me. And then sometimes I just all over honey and honey not all over me. <laughs> I like me always all over. No, no, no. <laughs> Boy, always all over. So, <laughs> yeah, but I mean, you have to give and take. You know what I mean? People, people entitled to have them attitude change on a dime. But as I say, respect the thing. You know what I mean? And respect the people them. Attitude to because sometimes just you know, so sometimes like every time they moi you feel. Yeah, we have to respect them, each you know other's what I mean? space and stuff and sometimes people just don't know how to give mm. you that breathing space. They just wanna be all up on you. Mm. And um especially if we've been living and you know, been living together for a long time, it is good to have a little bit of space. Like sometimes we're here and he's upstairs, I'm downstairs. And I'm doing my own thing and he's doing his own thing and and I think that's healthy, you know, we don't always have to be in the same room at all times doing things, you know? Real thing, real thing. So. The next one says, if they've cheated on their last partner. With you. Oh, yeah, with you. Mm. If I'm me, make she cheat, and a red flag. But if she just come <laughs> cheat, so, red flag. <laughs> Really? <laughs> so if I mean, like if I, if I mean, I'm not going to make you cheat, don't get me wrong, right? Eh? But if, if, let's say she and the boss in an argument, and she called me and she said, yo, Jerry, I violate star, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? And I say, yo, come check my man, you know what I mean? You need to take your mind off of the thing. She come over there and she cry and, you know what I mean? And I say, yo, John, you know what? You know? No, no, a red flag for that because guess what? She needs to end that relationship. If she and the man in a yeah, problem but... and them know, say, they no longer want to be together or whatever, then she needs to end that relationship. If she doesn't end that relationship, she's actually still cheating because she's with that guy, so she's cheating on him. So, you yeah, she... come to show you and her get together, yeah, and she then she to... starts doing this, you know, you and her start having arguments, mm. and another guy holler at her and whatever. Yeah. I mean, she gonna do the same thing to you. So, red flag. Yeah, it's a, it's a red flag, don't get me wrong, but as I said, I can't judge her if I me mean, make shit. can't justify it, a red flag. Straight. Uh, red flag, she said. <laughs> <laughs> they have different financial values than you. That one is a red flag for me because me can I try to save a thing and you just want to spin out everything or vice versa. You can I try to build a thing and as the new phone come out, I want it and the last week I get one phone or me the latest shoes and the food in the house. You know what I mean? You know the values of a balance. You get me? I understand say, me not to save as much as you or you might not save as much as me but we have to have an aim, we have to have a goal. We have to say, honey, we are paying rent now. We want a house for mortgage. Our only we buy a house now. We want an income property. Our only we have one income property. Make we get a second one. You know what I mean? Things mm -hmm. like that. You know what I mean? But if me can I say, oh, me pay, we are pay rent now. Only make we get a mortgage. And I say, yo, me are rent in a rent place. You know? You know what I mean? Or why only we are pay, we are lease that car. Make we buy something for ourselves. You say, no man. But we have a lease when we can just return it if something wrong with it. And you know what I mean? Them thing that cause problems. If the two only like is pay rent, fine. But if we don't have different values financially, I think that's going to be a problem. That's true. Yeah. I think you sum it up pretty good. Yeah, definitely, definitely. All right. Next one. They make fun of you during sex. Uh, if you laugh off of it during sex, straight red, red flag. flag. <laughs> you better go. <laughs> like, laugh after who? But where did I laugh after? All right. What, what, what was it sweet, yeah? <clears throat> sweet is until you laugh at that person? Well, we might take it as laugh off, but suppose you laugh with me. Or, or what if she said, Oh, you so quick. <laughs> well, I <read> like <laughs> yeah, but if that person, you know, you're dating him and start making fun of you um, during sex, that's a red flag because ain't no joke thing around here. Yeah, it's a red flag, but I mean, if you're dating and them do that, that's a red flag. But after, after years of being together, I mean, you can't live again, so you might as well just laugh with them. <laughs> and lastly, they refuse to make your relationship public. Red flag, where you hide. Look how my beautiful, look how my nice. Hmm? I want everybody to know about me. Don't. <laughs> but suppose him not nice, I'm beautiful. Me will carry him off. My nicest will rub off on him. But you never so, respect the man's privacy. No, sir. 
<laughs> the time that we're living in now in this social life that we're living in, mm. no sir. So, so everybody, no, everybody have to know about me. So no, no privacy enough for that? To some degree, but I mean, he has a Facebook, me have Facebook, I'm not friends on his Facebook, he's not friends on my Facebook, like, what? Say what now? That's a red flag for me. <laughs> no, I'm a red flag that for real, man. Yeah, if, if we are dating, and nobody can know about me and you know what I mean? We can't meet your friend them. Yeah, you, know you only I mean? hear about the friends yeah. them where you never actually me, get to meet the friends. I don't know where you like, live. What? You see me? I say, when you come link me, you drive out two hours like you live in a two cities down. So, no, bossy. Oh. That, 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 that kind of drastic. Right. That's a straight red flag. So, guys, this was very, 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 very fun. Yep. You know, and as always, we enjoyed making this video. Um, subscribe if you new. make sure you subscribe Papi sure doing crazy things we're working on some things right now still in the background but it's just taking it's taking longer to be produced to put it that way you know what i mean so we're keeping these videos coming out and we you know we're just keeping it nice and entertaining you know as we say keeping family values at the at the, fo at the forefront of everything putting god first all the time and make sure you're not having a notification on because you know i miss nothing yeah. Not no whatsoever. And we definitely appreciate all the love and all the support that you guys been showing us. Like, yo, highly appreciated. Yeah, and I love the thing. I would love one too. You know. So until next time, guys. Be safe out there. Stay quarantined again. If you don't have no reason for go out there, stay inside. Yep. You know what I mean? Just abide by the precautionary measures, all the rules, regulations. You know what I mean? Our church luck. So if church lack on the must know, say so yo, Take it can plastic. have drastic, yeah. yeah. So just stay inside, just be safe. Just go and watch some puppy show, man. You know what I mean? Enjoy the thing. And until next time, peace. peace. You said one more? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> one more? Man! I don't even think how you said that. No, just <laughs> said one more. <laughs> Bye guys. <laughs>